third mod. I got some new switches. I had to do it. I love it. There's nothing in that hole anymore. That's gonna be a fixed EQ most likely. And this is a bypass. I found a mod online and then it's the first time I edited a mod. These are three position. It's a series, split, and parallel. And the bypass bypasses it, but then it is still affected. So there's this grand circuit that I have to learn because you change the phase of things whenever you start switching the uh, taps on the coils from the humbuckers. When you start switching them around, you start changing the whole dynamic of everything. And so that even affects the bypass. The bypass is heading off the neck before it goes to anything else and sending it straight to the jack. But even still, the way in which the uh, coils are routed or wired changes the effect. It definitely boosts though. And then the bottom, which for me is uh, the neck, I reversed it from a Les Paul. So it's reversed from a Les Paul. I like it like that. It gives me the sounds that I wanted from the parallel mod. And it does give a boost that I wanted right here. I can palm mute and not leave the saddle and flip it. That's what I really wanted. So for now, I'll keep this bypass. I'll decide on these. I wanted a two position, really, but it was the easiest way. Split coils just on the way to the different wiring, so it's like a no-brainer, I guess, to have it. But I could do that split coil now that I know that parallel gives me that strat tone that I like with a little drive and less hiss. So let's go through it. We're in the neck. And then this is humbucker series, standard. And a bypass off. And we sound like this. And then we'll go up. This is humbucker series mode. It's kind of nice. Split coil. So there's six very usable tones right there. Six nice sounds. And then parallel is very similar but without the hiss. Against split. So it's almost imperceivable between split and parallel. In the uh, series, which is standard humbucker wiring, I'm getting a neck on my bypass and a bridge, so it's louder altogether. So that works too. But then, since we're in series, now my three position. Uh, I'm doing the neck. No difference. So no difference if you're in the neck and series. Let's see. Now we're in parallel. Neck. So again, no difference. But when you go in the middle, let's see. That's right, because both pickups is parallel between the two on a regular Les Paul, so it does boost a little. If I have the neck in the split coil, it turns off my bypass. But the other one can be in split coil as long as... The neck is not, the bridge can be in split coil. And it works. So it is sort of a, uh, a kill. So I made a kill switch inadvertently. There is no change though when you do uh, you know one series one parallel it makes no freaking difference I was hoping there would be a lot more interplay between the two so um, I got grilled in the Facebook groups 
Um, but that was good. I knew it this. So I figured out more functionality. So there is a difference uh, when you switch these two here. So this would be neck, parallel, and bridge series, bypass off, and that gives me... And then the uh, selector is in the bridge mode. So this gives me... That gives me a lead. Gives me a bridge lead. Now this gives me neck clean parallel. So this is what I figured out. A max volume now. A max volume. So I trim this down. With the bypass off, I've got that pickup in series, so it's going to be louder. So I trim the volume. Then I go here, this is now neck, parallel, so that's my strat sound. Volume doesn't affect it, so I will adjust my amp until this sounds good. So we, now we start with the bypass. So before I was trying to use the bypass as a boost, but I turned my thinking around and now I'm using the bypass for my clean, which I prefer the neck for clean, which is probably why I did this uh, inadvertently. I subconsciously knew uh, that I wanted to do the neck because this gives me the nice clean. You get the idea, so uh, that's the brilliance of it, um, in the backwards use. So that was the lead with the volume trimmed so that the humbucker is still kind of balanced with the parallel bridge that's so using the bypass in a reverse. So that's my one um, epiphany. So now I switch these. All right, and now the neck in series. So it's going to be louder in, in the most mid. That's what I originally wanted. I wanted the neck to be the beefy mid-rangey lead. So that's series humbucker. All right. So now the bypass is a boost because I've got my neck on series and then I put my uh, bridge on parallel. Turn the volume back up because I need that. <coughs> So in this mode, I'm using bypass first again to establish a rhythm with a nice beefy uh, Again, these are two things that I'm doing with the uh, selector still at the bridge. So kind of like that. 
So that's another combination with these different. You see that? So um, that's the epiphany I had. So the, the mod is completely functional. The only thing that's weird is that in single coil mode, um, it cancels it out. Uh, when you're in, and then the bridge it does nothing but that makes sense because you're in bridge so I can't blame the mod for that so it's actually a pretty darn good mod I'm pretty darn happy it's got some nice transitions uh, and it does look cool um, I might do a uh, push button for the tone uh, not a kill switch uh, so not a momentary but a latching uh, flush push button move this toggle down here push button in the middle so that's an idea there but uh, yes I'm very happy so this is three mods so far I've done and uh, yeah I'm definitely liking I'm liking that my solder joints work <laughs> took hours and hours and hours I'll tell you that and I had to route out my I had to route out my body I'll show a picture of that it came out pretty good actually um, yeah, let's hear a little distortion. And then parallel. that obviously having the bridge and then switch real quick in either parallel or series so anyway pretty happy with uh, in general it's fun tweaking on it there's only a, other, a couple other mods uh, that I want to try uh, this is a blower switch often called or bypass and you can bypass after the switch or before the switch I did before the switch which these act as like a switch, so I did before these. So I could do after these before the switch, or I could do after these in the switch before the volume. Uh, I just wanted to hit it off the pass, get the most boost, and I did, but like I said, that means that the, uh, the neck pickup is unaffected when you're on it by the neck boost, so that makes sense. But anyway, it came out pretty good. I like the look. Shaka. I love my little little guy right there. I freaking love it. Thank you for checking out um, Guitar Tech. <laughs> Ruin your guitar now. Warranty is no good. Now, let's start cutting into it. Yeah. Hey, soft and slow pan. Look at that. Ooh. <laughs>